Wow, I am a toaster. What the? I am a fucking toaster? Alright, uh, we're live. We, uh, we don't have the camera on because I have this heavenly glow behind me. And I would rather not want to have to deal with it, so. The camera, the camera stays off. Uh, I need videos. And I also work. Literally in two hours. So we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna play SCP. We just got done with the dragons and shit. Dragon sore. Little paper dragons, me too. But what happened to those cute little ones? Awesome, but where are they being? But what happened to those cute little? I'm gonna say where they contain now. At the record reliquary research institute, Dr. Daniel, supervising director, I should remain silent. I mean, all this Ghent. I thought you didn't attend the monthly lecture. Under the direction of Dr. Ghent, has spent two years researching, so he knows far more than we do. Oh, Jesus. All that had. I see if he didn't see me look him on again, but really imagine hiding files and uh, piles of cute little fairy books. Or oh, hard, I'm going back to work, but I'm going to stress that fear SP did not suit me. I want to get to some interesting shit. Because I think the far most interesting one was the second one with the black box. So far, the best art style was the dragon one. Verifying login. All right, what do we got today? Yorkshire, England. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Submit. Give me to the good stuff. That's all I want. I want to play the game. I want to play the game. There we go. Carl. The boss. Remember Arthur that needs to be sorted. The others are in the field, so you have to take over. Alright, cool. Mission is an emergency, Carl. It's beyond your current level. Alright. But your recent performance has proven that you have the ability to accomplish it. I understand. Remember. Stay sane and always in awe. Alright, get to it then. SCP-23901 Here we go. Something interesting. <clears throat> D-6744. Please provide your identification code according to the mission letter. Four and twenty blackbirds. Uh, tell me, Doc. When was the last time this rag on my head was washed? D-6744, according to the 7th edition of the Security Regulation Amendment, you must first provide your identification Where are the numbers, Mason? Otherwise, you will be executed. All right, all right. Oh, I see a soldier. Birds baked in a pie. You're a real fan of these formalities. Everybody's Another one? Right by the book with you. Oh, what's up? Oh, God. 
Mike Donald, consciousness intrusion expert, former leader of Yeah, those are the guys I saw earlier. Where's the red? Where's the red? Spider. Now, level D personnel. Number 6744. Is this going to be an underwater mission? What the hell you want me to do? It's going to be an underwater mission. Do you know about the witch plan? I've heard the name, that's all. The plan is under the direct command of O5. Every last detail of the plan is protected by the strictest confidential terms. So what? D6744. What you're about to witness is top secret information. What the foundation. fuck is that? The hell is going on? A few hours ago, something went wrong with the witch plan experiment. The energy of the human anomaly, SCP-239, is out of control and has begun diffusing outward, disintegrating everything it touches. You guys seriously never cease to amaze me. SCP-239 is now a ticking time bomb. She could go off at any moment. D-6744, I need you to enter the consciousness of SCP-239 to stop this bomb from this. exploding. I can do this. Zero key, fully charged and ready to uh, enter up, the target consciousness space. Begin the program. I got this. Consciousness uh, begins what's to link. Uh, D6744, we fuck. don't have much time. Hold it. Fuck, fuck, wait, Two. wait, wait. wait. I got this. This is the bomb. Just the bomb. I got this. I can do it. I can do it. I can do it. Camus Magum. I hope they don't fall over. No, my train. Hey, horse. There's one loud horse. D6744. Can you hear me? Son no. of a bitch! Fuck you! The situation is urgent. If you were still the way you used to be, you would have done the same. Oh, hello there? Uh, hey, wait! D6744, what did you see? A child. A little girl, but she ran away when she saw me. Interaction that little girl, busy. SCP-239, what else have you discovered? Sorry. I'm sorry. Help. Help me. The girl's consciousness is severely damaged. That probably explains her total loss of energy control. Then how should we proceed? What? I'll have to add her preconscious. If there's a solution to this, it's gonna be in there. Good. D6744. I don't know what's going really on, but right it's person cool. D-6744, I must remind you, SCP-239 is no ordinary girl. She is uniquely dangerous. This is not cool. Forget. Yeah, I got it. I'm dangerous too, don't forget. going on Passion, French, resin, I'm very intrigued Sing, though stone green touch Does the audio work yet by the way cuz it's still very loud Oh, it actually does work Holy now. Of... Oh, it's literally go this way. It's just the wrong way. That was the wrong way. 
When attacked by an unknown source, it is wise to run. Yeah, I was doing that. Alright, so I head left instead of right. I wish I had some way of knowing that. Oh, the sign does say exit. Alright, so that's it. Just follow the signs that say exit. I don't know what's going on. I'm confused as shit, but I'm having a good time. Fire's employee card. find an employee guard. So I can't get in here. Oh. Reset puzzle. What is it? I'm Dr. Pierce. I don't know what how that puzzle worked. SCP-239. Okay, let us begin. First, set voltage strength at 30 kilovolts. Power on. Yes, electrocuting children. Voltage intensity must be insufficient. I'll need a new test site, along with new equipment that can handle a greater voltage load. I don't, I don't think... I don't think so, my guy. I don't, I don't think shocking a, a child is the best... The best, uh... Thing to do. Because then she's gonna get angry. Is 239. It's a child, but why is she here? Bird's nest calling D6744. So confused. Copy. Copy. Uh, the energy of I'm just making videos before I gotta go to work. What's your situation? The situation's more complicated than I thought. I'm gonna need more time. Be quick about it. I got it. Quit rushing me. I currently have no clue what's going on. But when does that ever... When, 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 when do I ever know what's going on? Heard what? O5 is displeased with the slow progress of Dr. Pierce's experiments. They've appointed a new Work director to take over the project. You sure it's not just a rumor? Today's morning session was chaired by Dr. Pierce. It's true. Trust me. If I'm being honest, I don't really like Dr. Pierce. Something about him, you know, just gives me the <coughs> He's coming. Stop. Hello. Alright, we gotta re link all fragments in correct order. Links cannot intersect. Fragments can only be linked once. Okay. There you go. I'm a smart boy. How are the preparations for the experiment coming along? Equipment's been checked. Everything is ready. 
Three of eight. Four of eight. Sam went to the counseling room after yesterday's experiment. Yeah, I'll make the door for you guys. Oh, never mind. Agent, and let Arthur take his place. I don't have an employee key card. Let me in. I have an employee key card now. Power switch on. Set voltage strength to 250 kilovolts. Dr. Pierce, the heart rate of SCP-239 has now that exceeded a fucking 160. Car? Her physiological indicators are quickly approaching their limit. Perhaps we should consider pausing for a while. Continue. Pressurize. Set to 250 kilovolts. Go. Now. SCP-239. Pay close attention to my instructions. Crush that car in front of you. So they're torturing a child with psychic abilities. For some reason. What's the meaning of this? Sean Pierce. Violet. Long time, Sean. What's it been? Seven years? I've got no time to play catch up with you. Not a great first impression you're leaving either. Barging into my lab and interfering with my experiments. I I want to know what's going on more. And I guess that's kind of the purpose of it is you don't know what's going on until like near the end. You haven't changed one bit, Sean. Well, if you want to talk business, then let's talk business. You should have a look at this first. This is... No. What is it? This is O5's mandate. Effective immediately. Which plan and all SCP-239 experiments will be led by me. No, that's... No! This is a mistake. It's not possible. Don't take it personal, Sean. The simple fact is that the development of SCP-239 is eight. moving too slow. They want a more ambitious approach. A new process, if you will. A new process? What new process? Just what do you know about process? Please, Violet, enlighten me. Sean, let us end our bickering with this. Victory comes to those who fight, and to those who last. I got a pipe. Just, just a pipe. Ma'am, I don't know what's going on, is the thing. Bird's nest, well, I wish I knew what was going on. Just what exactly is which plan? Thank you. That's not your concern. Oh my god. Focus on the mission at hand. So much Stop figuring out. Spread of energy diffusion released by SCP-239 and do it quick. Yeah, sure. Aha. Uh -huh. I'm going this way. Object class Keter? Probably because psychic abilities. Yeah, that makes sense why she's Keter. So far as all I know is it's a it's a child with psychic abilities who they are torturing. That was an easy one. Director tattoo. The storybooks and toys we ordered have arrived at C3 warehouse. Good. Oh, I missed a file in 2003. The bed and daily necessities are all in place. The demolition of the ARB potential development plan will be completed next. Good and good. Now, how about the formal meeting with our little princess? Yeah, I got an employee keycard. Wait a second, I'm just over here. 
Oh my god, I head this way anyway. I was just there to help. She wanted nothing to do with me. I have a key card, right? So I can go on these doors now? I don't have it anymore? That's dumb. Who are you? My name is Violet Tattoo. You can just call me Violet. I will take care of you from now on. No one will hurt you. Oh, no, thanks again. for the subscription. I appreciate that a lot. Oh, now I'm in here. Cool. That's it for today's bedtime story. Hi. We'll have a little test tomorrow. You need your rest. I'm afraid. S sleep. Nightmares. You need to work on your sentences. Are you afraid of having nightmares again? Yes. Oh, the cameras are locked on me for some reason. Just remember what I told you. When you feel scared, just close your eyes. Imagine your little friends in the stories all running out of their books to come play with you. Then you won't be afraid. Get some sleep now. Remember to imagine those beautiful images. What is going on? Imagine. Imagine. Beautiful images. A long, long time ago. Oh, I thought it was the dragon storybook again. I was about to fucking die. Is that a turtle? Oh my god, it's a turtle. Tell you how to get a higher sub tier? Uh, what do you mean by a higher sub tier? It's like a brain? It kinda does, but look, it's a turtle, he's just chilling. Because you can either pay more for higher sub tiers. Yeah, tier one sub. So tier two is more money than a tier one, and tier three is more money than a tier. Whatever. And basically, the higher tiers is the more money you pay. Bye, turtle. For six months, wow, I fucking appreciate I appreciate that. It pulls back and whispers. There should be beautiful. That means a lot. Robin flaps its wings and flies away. Also, this story took a very dramatic turn. The hippos let out a loud yawn. The house should be built in a pool. So we can bathe anytime and sleep anytime. The robin shakes off the oh, I appreciate that. Flies away. I need to start continuing to make more. Or do more. Oh, is this Flappy Bird? Playing Flappy Bird at a snail's pace. This story took a very wide turn, but now I get why that guy in the beginning was like, 
an electric dude because I think it was the 239's adaptation of the doctor that was running tests on her and he was always shocking her and shit. So it would make sense that that guy was there. Because in her eyes, he was just an evil monster shocking her. Because it seems like Violet, or however you pronounce her fucking name, it seems like Violet, uh... What is it? Seems a lot nicer to her. Also, I'm just zoning out what she's talking about. I have no clue. Truth is not far, for it lays within our very hearts. Robin, what kind of home do you want? The Robin says, the home. Get me out of this fucking story, is what the Robin says. SCP 239, what are you doing? What's going on here? What's happening? SCP 239, we have to work and rest according to plan. But I... Alex, clear up the mess. At once, Director. SCP-239, this is all for your own good. What happened? You must be obedient and complete tomorrow's test. After that, I'll give you a gift. A gift? All right. Back to sleep now, SCP-239. Why are you... Wait, why are they scolding her? What? I don't get why they were scolding her. What did she do? So I'm assuming going this way gets the brightest. Okay, never mind. It's not that way. I want to go this way though. It's locked off. Oh, now I don't have a key card. That's awesome. Never lets me explore. Oh, and four out of six for collectibles. So I think we have one more thing in this in 2004. Oh, that's a. Uh... Hmm. What happened? This I don't think it's 2004 anymore. I'll see to it, Director. What shall we do with these creations of SC239? Destroy them. Is that what's happening? She's creating things like the fucking robins and shit from her stories. Yo, dude, that's wild. I think I'm starting to put her together. So she was tortured by the one doctor, so that's why she has the image of the bad, big bad dude. She got transferred to Violet, who treated her a little bit with more respect and whatnot. But... Uh, unlocked her potential too much, and now she's able to create things with her mind. Director Tattoo, the experimental site has been fully prepared. The report may begin at any time. Excellent. If today's experiment goes smoothly, I will have full control over which plan. Go, check again to be sure that everything is in place. There can be no omissions. At once, Director. Violet, hey! Violet! Violet! I'm very busy at the moment. We'll be presenting which plan's progress to the open. I think I have it on lock. Right, yes, that's just it. Listen. SCP-239's abilities are greater than you could ever imagine. She is infinitely more powerful now than when she was born. Your experimental procedures lack the proper controls. 
Any mistake, no matter how minuscule, could have irreversible consequences. Dr. Pierce, let us not forget that it was your previous missteps that caused us to miss the ideal incubation period for SCP-239. If we don't cultivate her using my method, the window of opportunity will be closed for good. But listen, if you I'm go just about using your method, you will repeat the accident that happened seven years ago. You do remember, don't you? Heisenberg, Freeman, Claire? Enough, Sean. Don't you dare bring up their names. Sean, the progress of civilization has always come with sacrifices. You don't get one without the other. To have the chance to harness the abilities of SCP-239, no price is too great. Violet, you are playing with fire. Dr. Pierce, it's time. I suggest you go to the first floor to get front row seats to civilization's next leap of progress. Violet! Listen to me! Violet! Alright. That gave no clarification. I am Violet Tattoo, and this is the meter test part one. SCP-239, do you remember our friend here? The little robin with the pretty feathers. Can you make it come out and play with us? You can manifest things. Good, SCP-239. Very well done. All right, let's continue with part two. Now we need to give the Robin a home. A home? Yes, a home. Just like in the storybook. The Robin needs a tree to call home. So let's give him a big tree. Robin, home. Not the tree. Okay, cool. We're turning it, or punishing a child again no for being a child. No storybooks. No pretty decorations. Back to that cold, ugly room. You don't want that, do you? No. No. Then take the goddamn tree for me. Everyone, no need to panic. This is all standard. SCP-239 will have a slight effect on the current when using her ability. It's perfectly normal. Very well done, SCP-239. Good. Perfect. Hey, pretty big tree. Well Under my guidance, SCP-239's abilities grow more and more powerful each day. Over time, we will expand the experimental content, and we will see even more advancements. SCP-239. Nah. I don't think you can. I'm still lost and confused. That's an order. Stop now. So it's just a child that can't control her powers. Sean? Sean! Sean! The backup door outside! Help me open it! Come on, quick! Violet, I told you. 
told you you were playing with fire. What the fuck? She didn't let me out. She's lost her mind. Yeah, she. She, she, she lost control of her powers. Open the damn thing. No. No, Violet. I can't. What? What do you mean? SCP-239 is out of control. I don't think a door is gonna stop her, Sean. Sean, Sean, I don't think a door is gonna stop her. Victory comes to those who fight, and to those who last. Sean, I think you're just being a fucking cuck right now. Sean, this is not that. Open the fucking thing. An accident of this magnitude. It's just what I need to prove myself. Sean, Sean, don't think like that. We can work together. We'll do it your way, your rules, your method, whatever you want. Oh. We'll do. I know. I'll quit. I'll resign. Which plan is all yours? Yeah, you are gonna quit. You're gonna quit under the rubble. I've never been so certain of success. No, Sean. Let's not think like that. Let's talk things through. You have proven invaluable, Violet. You will not die in vain. No, Sean. No, 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 no. You fuck. You fucking Sean. I quit. Sean. No, she just evaporated. Sorry. I'm sorry. Nah, don't be sorry. They probably deserved it. Well, Sean and Violet are ass hats. Energy output is getting out of hand. How much longer? So this is the witch plant, huh? Are we anything more than tools to you? No. It's not about that. No, not it's really. About saving the world. Either you fix this, or we're all screwed. What the world ever did to I'm me? What doing? Then move your ass and do it already. Yeah, suck my nuts. Quitting the foundation was a best suck decision. My in my life. Suck my nuts. Suck my nuts. All right, time to do this puzzle thing. Wow, it's so difficult. I now present to you the ARB Potential Development Device 2.0. This device is capable of not only better stimulating the potential of abnormal objects, but can also automatically turn on the is respective the electric field control. So long as the abnormal objects exceed the preset amplitude. Oh, thanks for the subscription this also. That the experiment is foolproof, with zero chance of runaway. The tragedy of Director Tau 2 cannot be repeated. We must learn from our mistakes. We must not forget the enormous power of SCP-239. And we must treat security as a top priority. Otherwise, all of this will be for nothing. Do not forget the credence we live by. Secure. Contain. Protect. This, we must uphold at every turn. You don't gotta be sorry, they deserved it. Hi, hello. It's okay. I just want to talk. No. Stay away. What happened? It, it's not your fault. Oh, shit. I think our mind's pretty set on what she wants to do. I think we should just, you know, find a new place to live. We don't need this universe, we'll find a different one. I'm playing as the the two three nine now. SCP two thirty nine. We will repeat the previous tests first. Experiment one. Strength test. Pass rate of ninety five percent. Voltage strength six hundred kilovolts. Power on. 
I will. I don't think I will. Are they giving me comfort words right now? I think they're giving me comfort words. Yeah, fuck that car. Press E for so long. Can you just hold it? No, you that's it's not press, it's hold. This entire time I've always thought it was press. I know why it always it, it feels like it takes forever to do it. that a move Oh, I made a car. I did not make a car. Test completed. Pass. I did make a car. Yeah, I think everyone deserves what's coming to them. I can do this. Oh, this is getting difficult. Fuck my nuts, Sean. Fuck my nuts, Sean. I hope you blow the generator out and I just murder you. Okay, this story, I haven't talked much, I'm just at a loss for words of what's going on. I wonder if you actually could get it. There's probably like some type of measure to make sure you don't, but oh, stop! This is not the right way. Cool. Cool. That was awesome. Immediately got seen and then got sent to a dead end.
Oh, he doesn't see me. He doesn't see me. Yeah, look how easy that was. So easy. All done. First try. I tried helping you and you like fucking like were like die. And like I told the foundation I suck my nuts. This is honestly the best comeback ever. D6744. Nicely done. Uh, hold on. The outflow of energy of SCP-239 has subsided and is now beginning to dissipate. We have regained control. Uh, just hold on. Again, a job well done. And then they and kill me for knowing too much. Can you just hold the fuck on and listen for a damn change? What's the matter? The problem hasn't yet been solved. She's still lost deep in her mental anguish. That's not our concern. Yeah, you're like, they don't give a fuck. Crisis has been averted. Innumerable lives have been saved. Your mission is complete. My mission's not complete until she is stable. Compassion in times of desperation leads only to the destruction of yourself. Three minutes. You owe me that much. For all this, you owe me. I can enter her subconscious and fix this. Or make it worse. Three minutes. Very well. I'll disconnect the synapse in three minutes. If you're not back, then so be it. I will show no compassion. Alright, speedrun. Even though I do think they're gonna disconnect it and I'm gonna get lost in it forever. Alright, three minutes. That's not the right way. Reset the puzzle. There we go. Speed run. Speed run. I don't need collectibles. I got three minutes. I'm such a smart boy. Hurry up with the cutscenes. I got three minutes. All right, two minutes left. I can do this, I can do this, I can do this, I can do this. Oh, there's blue now? Doesn't matter, just makes it easier. Just makes it easier. Alright, so when she was born, she like. SCP 239! She has a name. Oh. They only call her that, not her actual name. She wants to be called her name. Okay, that's kind of sad, actually. Like I said, it's literally only a child. It's not like an anomaly or something. It is literally just a child born with psychic abilities. Don't blame yourself. None of this is your fault. Maybe you weren't meant for this world. The story is really sad.
Robin says, the home I want, my home is squishy all over, with shiny warm lights and no more cold steel. Filled all the way with beautiful star stickers. Okay, I get it now. Everywhere. Everywhere. So when they were like, oh, give the Everywhere Robin go, a twinkle, home with a tree, like she relates herself to the Robin. Which is why she's like, I don't want to live in a tree. With, books, with the cutest animals inside. They only say nice things to me. They always want to chat with me. And there's the only one to say nice things and chat with me because so everyone else was... Just told her what to do, yelled at her, tortured her. Also, this is the dragon from the last story. So it just requires playing to understand. She's supposed to be a kid, and no one let her do that. Yeah, fuck so that shark. My home. Saguro's and there, she used her name. She just wants to be a child. Oh, oh, my head. Take a deep breath. Just some minor side effects from the force disconnection. She's not coming back. What? In the end, she chose to shut off her subconscious. She'll sleep forever, like a plant. Maybe that's for the best. Anyways, honestly, it is for the best for her too, because now she can be happy. It'll require some brainstorming. Not my concern. I'll arrange for someone to take you back. See you on the next mission. <laughs> Not in this lifetime. I didn't understand what that meant. But no, yeah, probably for the best. That, uh, she went to... She turned off her subconscious. Be what she wants. Happy. Doesn't have to listen to anyone. Well done, young man. I know I'm good, boss. I'm not gonna be a fucking cock. I'm keeping the subject in a state of comatose is the only viable solution. You're right, this place is not what I thought it was. To learn to understand and abide by the rules. When I handed this task to you, I was frankly rather worried about whether or not you would be able to complete it. Is it ready? What do you mean? How oh, do I get to see 069 or 049? Carl, someone wants to talk to you. Oh, this is the 05 council. L5. What? First, you need some more infection. What the fuck are you talking about? Is that over to the 15th floor? What are you talking about? Carl's just a name or a symbol. I right, go to the bathroom. Where's the elevator? That, I don't think, is supposed to be happening. That's a bug. Most definitely. <laughs> Take elevator to sector B24. Probably get through one more story and call it a day. November 13th, 2012. Enter room, wait for work notification. O four two six. O four two six. Carl, you'll have to follow my instructions. Do exactly as I say. There is an access card on the desk. Take it and exit through the door on the other 
side. The passcode is 0426. I already knew that. I'm that good. Find room B426 and run the program on the computer. You guys gonna have, like, send this in an email? Zero four two six. Enter room B four two six to the left. Four two six. Run the program on the computer. Room involves relevant content warning. Before entering, please confirm the personal information. After entering, please make sure the door is locked again. In the event of a containment breach, open the block. Okay. Four two six confidentially level three. I'll ask Euclid. All non level D staff covered in this manual have had their identities obscured. The events recorded in this manual may be accessed via the digital library level three or as it requires. Use the manual is covered by the confidential clause. Any staff found in the breach of the clause. Subject to immediate emotion, confirm. 426 sounds familiar. I can't remember what that is. No history of mental illness who was sentenced to life imprisonment for murder, nicknamed Chimney. His psychological condition was normal before he entered site blank, however. Build negative and pessimistic tendencies while in the prison, along with severe symptoms of nicotine addiction. Physical examination records show that D081 did not acquire any physical disabilities. Jaded, skeptical, and exhausted. Life and living are tough. When being awake and sleep are no longer regular, only the number of cigarettes left can give me a general sense of time. Only smoking can get me out of bed. Okay. Didn't even provide a mirror, but I don't need to see my face. But because he's in the one night in jail. What is going on? Put cigarette back. Still alive. Right, man. Pay attention, you know I can feel your life energy. What? Not just yours, but all lives. The transitions that happen to making the most life transitions. Beautiful thing, and they exist in abundance here. What the fuck are you talking about? It always led to unknown opportunities where everything is uncertain. I can see the man made chaos, disordered by another force that can't be called life. Idiot. Anyway, at least you're still alive. Yeah, what a great ending. Oh wait, one time for your task. Let me finish a cigarette. Come on, give me a break. I always follow orders, don't I? I can't even smoke anymore. Hurry up, damn it. <laughs> Freedom! Don't hang around here. Where am I going? Aren't you supposed to leave me? I like the music. You're ready. I get it, scary Jack. What can you detect in this thing anyway? No weapons, no metal, no smoking, no observation. No smoking, you have something against me, huh? Those hands. Oh, wait, one. I can hear you. What do you want me to do this time? There's a room on the bottom floor. You'd have to enter the room and observe the object on the table. Come back and report your findings once you complete the object. Do you understand? Oh, fucking freaks. Jesus, I'll never get used to this. Can't make this something less gross. This painting is called Los Angeles at 4 a.m. Interesting. Is this poster of an opera? These freaks watch opera? It's the Hanged Man Opera, I think. Are you kidding me? You have to talk to Ella, can you hear me? There's nothing wrong, right? 
the fucking poster. It's just a toaster. Sure, first, where are my cigarettes? Hat, I'll never guess where I hid my cigarettes. Damn, that's good. The only one turned live and reported to the doctor. You can start reporting. Well, on the table, I'm, uh, I'm about 10 inches wide and 6 inches tall, and I've made a stainless steel. Anything else? But also, I'm not sure what else you want me to say. Anything else? I'm not sure what else you want me to say. I'm a toaster. I'm a toaster. Put bread right in my slot, and I'll make a perfect fucking piece of toast. Good, you can go back to your room now. Good, what did I just say? Yeah, that was kind of weird. How he was like, I'm a toaster. Hey, Jimmy, there's something different. Some wonderful smell on you. What is it? Tempted it now. You're going to experience a new life, a different kind of existence. Shit, that sounds fucked up, man. You change. You're no longer bound by limitations. There's no beginning and no end, only chaos. Can you shut up? It's the end of life? I don't know. Maybe you're evolving. Why am I even trying to understand what you're saying? Feeling different now, right? I don't feel. I do feel strange. I think I'm just tired. Life needs motivation. Maybe you just need a cigarette. A cigarette? No, no, no. I don't need a cigarette. I need to charge up because I am a. I'm a toaster. I need to be plugged in to start working. Wow. I am a toaster. What the? I'm a fucking toaster? I feel so good. What am I doing? I need a charge. Yes, yes, I gotta charge myself up. Damn, there's no plug. They gave me all these cigarettes, but no plug. Maybe I can just make one myself. I got a wire. Piece of iron, I need to figure out how to make a plug. Choose two. And... That. Good, this is it. I can't wait to charge up. I'm just a literal toaster. I'm not a toaster. Observe as we've closed for about 30 minutes. During questioning, he could only provide a first-person description of SCP-426. Theo ate one return to his cell and began experiencing hallucinations, believing that he was a toaster. Oh wait, one died of electrocution of plugging in a self-made metal object in a socket because he felt like he required charging. That is absolutely fucking hilarious. OE2, named Dorothy Wilson, is a 65-year-old white female with no history of mental illness. OE2 psychological evaluation results were known when she entered Site Blank. Analysis shows that she is mentally strong and resistant to interrogation. She has caused several cellmates to commit suicide and several guards to betray the Blank Prison Institution. D082 was diagnosed with lymphia cancer before she was recruited by the Foundation. She was cleared for testing after we confirmed that her lymphia cancer would not affect her 426 test. So it's a toaster. That makes you believe you're a toaster. What happened here? I fell asleep. I'm sorry, maybe I misheard, but you were shouting. Oh, what was I yelling about? Every time I fall asleep, I think I'll never wake up again. You were yelling, fucking bread, give me bread. Did for my children. Whenever I think of them, it fills me with regret of what I did. Seven months ago, I diagnosed with cancer. Oh my god, I was already did that, Miss Boozlin. I made a lot of mistakes in my life. I came here on my own free will. You know, I think of this as a kind of redemption. Oh, sorry, we can't chat anymore. I can tell you about my children next time. I should return the stolen access card on the pillow. People should take care of how they should look when they're old. I wish everyone thinks like that. Oh, wait, you time for your task. Hello, young man. You don't look very happy today. And what happened? I'm not going back to the empty room for another day, am I? I know I should have complained, but it's awful boring. Don't mind me, Maggie. You know I don't have much time left. Time to go be another toaster, I guess. Sure to check. You're always standing. You don't trust me? Alright, it seems like you don't want to talk today. Good morning, Dr. H. Oh, 
My dear, you, you can call me Dottie. You will be in the innermost room today. You're tasked to observe the object on the table, then come back here to report your findings. Cough. You really should be more clear about these tasks, but this one sounds simple enough just as well. I might not be able to stand for too long. No, what a terrible smell. I don't use a nicer lavender scent. Those are all the paintings we've seen. It's a toaster! Looks familiar, I'm sure the empty room him before he says next door. I remember, I need to observe. Yes, just observe. Oh, is that my tonight is flaring up? Or did I just hear something wonderful? The lab room reported to the doctor. You can start your report. To be honest, I'm not sure this is what you need, dear. Start your report. Well, I'm a toaster about this wide and this high. Oh, and my youngest daughter uses the same model as me. Oh, I'm teal green. I think I look good in this color. Yes, yes, I like this coat of paint. I think I can still work. Mmm, what else? That's all I can say. Sorry, I'm not as rude as I used to be. Here, you can go back to your room now. Thank you. I'm glad to hear that. I am a toaster. Well, how are you feeling? I don't know. I mean, how do you feel about that task? Oh, I feel not too bad. Yes, I feel like I'm good. That's great, Ms. Wilson. To be honest, I was a little worried, I thought. I feel good. I feel... Great. Yes, wonderful. I have to do something. What do you mean you have to do something? Ms. Wilson? Ms. Wilson? You know what? There's been a little voice in my head. I think it's time for me to fulfill my duty. I'm a toaster. Time to get to work. I just want that as a screenshot. That's awesome. Not enough bread to toast. On the stolen access card. I need more bread. Work, work, bread, bread. I can feel. I can toast any kind of bread there is. Bread, bread, work, work. There's not enough. I can toast more. No, not the trash toast. Bread, bread, work, work. There's not enough. I can toast more. No problem for me. I'm the best model ever made. That's a lot of bread. Bread, bread, bread. Oh, look at my character. Oh, why is Bert taking so long to toast? Test report. Oh, wait, to observe the object closely for blank minutes. Five minutes later, she was only provided a first person description of SCP 426. Oh, wait, to begin to develop hallucination 15 minutes after returning to her cell. She believed she was a toaster and that she needed to toast bread. She died of internal bleeding due to acute gastric dilation. The autopsy found 16 kilograms of undigested bread in her stomach. This is a fucking awesome SCP. Test subject 083, named Adam Mor Moria. 38, white male, no history of mental illness. Psychological evaluation shows also that he a little violent and mani manic tendencies before entering site blank. He yelled, I'm a toaster, my insides need to be cleaned. After coming into contact with 426 blank times, he then swallowed 550 milliliters of dishwashing liquid and fell into a coma. It's uncertain at this time whether the effects of SCP-426 are still active. Observation is still underway. Damn it. Fuck. Fuck all of you. Oh, I threw your wake. Get yourself ready to out. What the hell am I doing here? What did you do to me? No one has done anything to you. Ah, that's convincing. I think I'm a fucking idiot. After that task, you drank industrial strength dishwashing liquid. What are you talking about? Don't fuck with me, I'll kick your goddamn ass. Oh, wait, three, what are you? What? What are you? I'm your fucking grandpa, that's what I am. I'm gonna fucking knock out your teeth one by fucking one. I'm going ready for the lab. Damn, why am I dizzy? I don't feel right. Feels like part of my brain is missing. Feels like I I'm. I am a toaster. I am a toaster. I am a toaster. I what am is a going toaster. on? Take 
Tick tock, tick, tick tock. What's your, what are you? Feeling dizzy with a headache? I'm a good toaster. Fuck, my head hurts. Where am I? I should be so confused lately. Oh, wait, three. Hey, you old fucker. Do you remember what you did after your last task? Are you willing to... Are you willing... Or observe the test subject. Listen here, I ain't doing shit no more. Just kill me now, you bastards. Fuck, mine is gonna explode. Guards sent out with back to serve for observing this doctor. Yeah, I've had enough, you old fucker. You aren't taking me. Return to the living quarters. No. Ah, uh, fine, I'll go back. I am a toaster. Shit, what's wrong with me? I shouldn't be like this. I should be. I am a toaster. I am a toaster. I am a toaster. This is a banger. Do you have anything to report? Come on, man, I'm broken. Broken, the doctor wants to know how you're feeling. You're definitely broken. I don't think I can toast any more bread. Bread? Screw screwdriver, there's sure something wrong with me. You need to go to the clinic? Open the door, I need to be fixed. Oh my god, bread. I'll try to toast this bread. That way I'll know if I'm really broken. There's something wrong with me. This is bad. Oh no. This is awesome. These people up. Uh. Stop everything now. We can kill you now. I'm broken. What are you? I'm, I'm not a good baby bear toaster. I can't toast anywhere, but yes, I can fix I myself. A I'm a toaster. toaster. I, I am, am a toaster. toaster. Test report. After the previous observation experience was interrupted, DOA removes the baby bear toaster and suffered from internal damage. She requested repairs on the way to the clinic. OA3 behaved aggressively and attacked the guard with a lethal weapon. She opened his abdomen and claimed that there were breadcrumbs jammed inside. OA3 eventually died of excessive bleeding. After conducting several tests with level D prisoners, the foundation has determined. That SCP-426 caused severe, severe mental harm to humans it has henceforth been defined as an info hazard. Thank you for reading the SCP-426 safety manual. Secure, contain, protect. I like that story. It should be saved, I think. Let's just check. We hit continue. Alright, cool. Uh, so, I thank you all for watching, and I'll see you on the 